Hey guys, Pyfire H2O back. And I watched another video of someone else doing this playthrough. And when they get, got to this part, here's what they did. They just, you know, turned right around and just walked this way. And what do you know? It's different. This game likes trolling you, apparently. So now, I think, now that I have figured this out, I can at least get through this part. Haha. Uh -huh. I can't really say it, but I figured it out. I just got lucky and like looked it up. So I got to thinking, like, uh, what to do? Did I do it? Did I do it wrong? So yeah. Ooh, it's close. Okay, yep, Mike's still messing up. I don't even know how much I just said and you guys didn't hear. Whatever. Anyway, I'll just repeat, reiterate what I was saying. It's 3 and something in the morning. I, I realize that I won't, I'm not going to be able to record, quote unquote, today. So, I thought I'd record something right now and then do the scheduled upload. Still gotta watch the mic and watching it like a hawk. So, if I stop moving for a second, or if I stop mid sentence, I already, already mentioned this before, but you know why. Okay. I'm still watching my mic. My mic. I'm not really watching the mic, I'm watching the sound. Uh, Whatever the word is. Uh, the sound output on OBS. There it goes. Yay. Okay. Uh, that's what I'm doing. I'm just watching it like a hawk. Making sure it doesn't stop. Because as soon as I stop seeing it moving, then I'm like, oh crap, I got. I stopped talking. Oh, suck for you, bro. see the reasoning for that. Okay, cut. Sleep soundly, Nina. And don't fear the night, with its long claws that scratch and its sharp teeth that bite. Under the covers, there's no need to hide, for your uncle's a monster, and he's on your side! <laughs> Nina! My adorable young niece! My, my, you're getting big! Sneaky. Sneaky. There, little lady. I see they need some adjustment. Let me take a look. Okay, young lady. Let's see what you learned. Oh. Oh, I guess I can't control the co cortex. I can't lead him on. Oh, she skips. That's so funny. It's sort of cute, too. Auto saving. Okay, no, she can't double jump. Good to know. Oh, cool. Press X to circle to jump, grab, and reel in. Oh, okay. At least her attacks are a lot better than Cortex's. No, thank you. Oh, more random. Uh, I don't know why it's like a heavy metal. My airship, without it, we're stranded. Tie it to something secure, I said. Hurry, Nina, or you'll miss the battle. What are you tied to? I wonder what Crash tied it to. Yeah, 
Get up. Lazy. Woo! Yeah. Okay. This is definitely weird. This is definitely different. Why? I just don't want to know why the heck her music's like all this heavy metal type stuff. No. Thank you. I'm glad I can continue the game. Okay, why is it not working? I am spazzing the button. It's not working. There it goes. Only hit circle when you only hit circle when you see the green, I guess. You know, if you look back on this, at this game, a lot of things can kill you. <laughs> so wait, if Cortex has a knee. Okay, this mic business is gonna start ticking me off. Anyway, as I was saying, if Cortex has a niece, that means he has at least a brother or a sister. And we don't hear anything about them at all. I wonder why. And then again, if you if you go to the Crash Bandicoot wiki. Says Cortex was like she's his only one confirmed uh, relative that we all know about, and he's the one who put these stupid claws in her hands. Not like they're not really stupid; they're pretty badass, to be honest. But yeah, he's the one who mutilated her. He's also one of the other thing. One of the only things that he actually cares about. Okay. Oh, I see you. Hey, you know what? What's the worst part about having? Oh, one second. I gotta mess with some settings really quick. Audio. Let's put it as default. Why not? Since it doesn't really matter. And hopefully it'll change it, or at least make it work better. But I think it, it only started doing that once I changed it over to like the actual blue snowball as the mic. That might be the case. Yeah! Kill everything. But... I really hope this doesn't, doesn't persist. Oh, crap! I was trying to see if she had, like... Uh... What's it called? Horns, but she doesn't. She just has spiked hair. And she's so... Heavy metal. Well then, okay. Okay, that didn't fix it. It still decided to go off. Oh, what? Oh, I hate this camera angle, but you can't. It's like stuck on. Where it just ch changes, changes by itself. Ooh, that's close. Aha. Uh -huh. How'd you still how'd you survive? That didn't work. Get out of here. We fall. So I don't yeah, this mic must be going bad. Because I started using this mic all the way back when I first my first Crash Bandicoot video. So I guess it just happens, I guess. 
Turn this way, Nina. Okay. Just hitting everyone meticulously. And my fire button didn't work. And I'm starting all the way back here. Okay, talk to you guys in a moment. Okay, we're back. That was weird that the sword spawned in first. <laughs> oh crap. That was close. These guys take two hits. Because they're special. Oh wait, I, I lost. Uh, Uka. Uka. No, I didn't. I never grabbed him. Umaraga. Oh, okay. I guess we're past Lamp Pages over. Well. This was a good video, I guess. Good stopping point. Anyhow, thank you for watching, subscribing if you did, and sharing this video around if you did. And if you don't, if you ever didn't do any of those, still thank you. You at least took the time out of your day to watch this. But I do employ. As I was saying before, Mike decided to cut out. I'll talk to you guys in the next video, whatever I make. Bye.